Hi everyone, this is Fagun Shah from Integration Lab YouTube channel and today we are going to see how can you replace the images in Google Doc template uh, generation, right? So uh, you must already have uh, used uh, Google Doc uh, generation from the template, right? For example, we have template like this. You have already, uh, you already must have known that you can replace this uh, variables and other things, right? But many people don't know how to replace the images, right? So this will be the template. This will be the Google Doc generated from it. And this will be the PDF saved in the Google Drive folder, right? So we are going to see a workflow to implement this uh, kind of similar thing in today's video, right? So yeah, let's get started. So the first thing, for form builder, we are using Elementor Pro form and we are sending data to public connect using their webhook. OK, and the template which I got is from template.net. So full credits to them. It was a free template. I just downloaded it and changed the some of the fields and other things. Right. So but yeah. And uh, if you are a video game fan, you will know which university is this. OK, so yeah then the next step is the public connect workflow so okay one more thing about the template here you can see this uh, placeholder kind of image right so you must have one image in place for student photo in here right because that is the our ultimate goal that we want to replace this image with students image so one placeholder image should be there always okay now uh, in order to pass this image we need to first create a workflow so we will go to public connect and here you can see i have already captured this data if you don't know how to capture this data please watch videos on public youtube channel or my channel okay and or just go through my playlist uh, on how to get started with public connect or automation no code automation space right so yeah the next step will be we will create a document from template which is a standard thing right we are passing uh, choosing the template document university admission form template uh, and we are passing the new documents location and other fields which are available in there so documents name will be the students name and we are passing other things like uh, percentage blood group school which we have collected from the elementor pro form right now the next step will be delay because i don't want to call the google uh, api too frequently right so i will use the delay as the next step just a one minute of delay and then comes the main part which is the replace image of a document right so in the second step we generated the image which gave us the document id right now what we want is we want to replace the image in that particular document in my case there is only one image but in your case it can be one two three four five images right so what we want is we want to pass this document id dynamically that's why i have clicked on this map toggle and passed it from the second step right uh, don't touch the image replace method keep it keep it as it is and i am passing the image url from the step one since it is a direct image url uh, via wordpress it is you can just pass it directly without uploading it on any other platform okay and after doing that it will give us the google doc with the image replace right now in the next step again i am adding delay because i don't want to call the apis of google very fast that's why and in the next step i am sharing it with anyone to get the pdf link uh, this is the pdf link we are getting okay by doing that action and in the last step i am uploading it to a particular folder right so here is my folder structure and school for uh, this is the template school form documents school form pdfs right now let's try to submit one and let's check how it works exactly right so i am going to pass the name and detail yes meta yes meta at gmail.com date of birth uh yeah let's choose something else uh sixth okay and uh, let's pass this number degree eating jason society and it is not taking eating verdansk 
heights okay and high school was verdun school and blood group will be o positive and 12th result will be let's say 50% okay and yeah let's try to choose an image so the fake ai photos and let's go here click on send right and uh, now if we go to form docs it should show us the yash meta doc created from the text we just received right and that was the second step but you can still see that the image is not replaced right it is still showing us the placeholder image right why because we have added one minute of delay so it doesn't uh, change it too quickly right so now it has changed it to the proper photo right and now if we go to pdf uh, folder it is still showing only one file which is a old one right but as soon as the time changes to 11:43 a am it should add one extra file in here as well right so that's how it's going to work uh, basically it's first going to generate a document with the text variables then it was going to generate a, uh, then it's going to replace that image inside uh, that particular newly generated uh, document and after that it is going to convert that to a pdf and upload to a particular folder in your google drive right so let's see how many more seconds we need to wait almost 10 to 15 seconds more till then just a reminder if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe to it and yeah that will support me a lot okay thank you and yeah let's refresh it one more time and as you can see here let's open this pdf for us and let's see okay you can see the name and other things are re uh, replaced dynamically right so that's how it's going to work this is how you can replace images in google doc template okay so from now on if you have uh, by the way this use case was presented like months ago by one of the user in uh, public and a group i think so and they wanted to like replace the images in the google doc that was also one of the form like i think so the university admission form or something like that okay and uh, yeah at that time i helped them and yeah now i am sharing this solution with you as well everyone publicly right so yeah i will share the workflow link and uh, google doc template link in the description of the video uh, see you in the next video till then don't forget to subscribe bye bye thank you